Yo, let's go YouTube. It's your boy, Big Z. State basketball coming up on Monday. Boys are leaving at 8 o'clock in the morning and staying at the Marriott Hotel by Jordan Creek Mall. Why are you telling them all this? Um, just in case they want to stay in the same hotel. I have no idea if there's going to, there probably will be a pet bus or something, but so far I have no information on that. Um, our game is at 6.35. On Monday. On Monday. I already said that. Um, they play against Trainer, the Cardinal. Came yeah. in with a solid record. Yo, what's our theme for that night? Oh, yeah, the theme for the Pride Tribe, we're doing a blackout fake out. Uh, so basically what we need you guys to do is wear black to the game. Uh, and then we need you to wear your red state shirt underneath the black. And if you don't have a red state shirt, which you should have got, just wear any red shirt. And then right at tip off when we're doing, oh, 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 we're gonna take off the black and we're gonna be wearing red. So we're faking them out because they're gonna think we're wearing black, but we're actually wearing red. Probably break their ankles with that. Probably. And then we're going to be the loudest student section there because we are the Pride Tribe. And I need you guys all yelling. If we were to win, we would then play Thursday. I don't know what time. Would play 2 o'clock. Uh, we'll play Thursday at 2 o'clock. And would play Friday for sure. Welcome back to the Road to Wells. I'm your host. <coughs> Sitting next to me, we got DeMarcus, LaMarcus, Marcus, DeMarcus and Luanzo. Today on the show we're going to be talking about the Four City Basketball. We're going to continue to talk about Four City Basketball's road to Wells. Alright, so back to our question and answer session with Four City's star basketball players DeMarcus, LaMarcus, DeMarcus, Marcus, and Luanzo. So we are going to talk about the name of the show. Marcus, give us the name of the show. Road to Wells. The show is called The Road to Wells, so we're going to talk about Wells Fargo Arena. And we've made it to Wells, so. We made it to Wells. On to state. On to state. So now the show's name has changed to just Wells. Mark that down in your calendar that, and your TV guy that the show has been now changed to Wells. Just Wells. Right. And the Forest City Indians are going to play. Like Luanzo said. Four City High School, these two, these star players right here, they will be traveling Road to Wells, uh, Road to Wells, they will be traveling on the road to get to Wells Fargo and play Trainer, Trainer High School, the Cardinal. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with our special guest for the day, Isaiah Lushen. <laughs> Hello. Uh, Lushen has been a key component to the Indians basketball team this season. Lushen, talk about your season and how it's been going. Uh, it's been going very good. We're, I guess we're on a 21 game winning streak. We already talked about that. Oh. Um, Lushen, uh, earlier in the video we talked about um, the game at Britt. Uh, the Indians ended up winning that game. Uh, how did you feel about that game and uh, um, what do you think you could have done better to maybe throw one down against Britt? Well, I did get followed by Jordan Savoy. I told you video. <laughs> yeah. And I could have went up, jumped higher. See, you hear, you heard it here first from the man himself, Isaiah Lushen. Everybody, he was going to throw it down. Isaiah, what are you going to do um, on Monday against Trainer? How, how are you going to control uh, the Trainer offense? Just, I'm going to play post defense. You're playing. You're gonna play defense. Yeah. That's great. Uh, what else are you gonna do besides play defense? Um, I uh heard that Jordan Savoy and the Brit uh Eagles will be playing before you guys. Uh, is there any concern about Savoy coming out of the locker room and following you during the game? No concern. Uh, no concern at all. Okay. Um, 
Thank you. Thank you for your time. Everybody, this has been Isaiah Lushen, star basketball player on the Four City Indians. There he is, the star. We need to get an interview. We need an interview. We need an interview. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am here with one of the stars of the team. Uh, Tyler, we just got done talking to Isaiah Lushen. Uh, we got done talking about uh, how, uh, he, how he's trying to get a try to control trainer. What do you think about trainer and how are you going to work? I'm going to try to score more points than they do. I'll try to. Yeah, that's a good comment. You know, scoring more points is a key component to beating the team. Uh, last time I checked, uh, the team with the most points in the scoreboard at the end of the game does win the game. Uh, how do you feel about that? That's how it works. That, that is how it works. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that was star basketball player Tyler Anderson. Okay, one, <laughs> Luke, we talked to Isaiah Lushen earlier today. Oh, yeah. uh, there's Isaiah right there. We talked to Isaiah earlier today. Uh, we talked about how... Uh, he was trying to control Trainer and uh, score more points than them. What do you think you're going to do to score more points than Trainer? Uh, well, I'm just going to put the ball in the hoop and not let them put the ball in the hoop. If you get a chance, would you dunk against Trainer? Yeah, but I can't. So. Um, let's talk about your blocks in practice, Luke. How many do you get a practice? Would you say? Um, I'd say like um, five, but at least four of them are fouls. So. Luke, you can't think that way, because if you think you're going to get a foul, <laughs> the rest going to call you for a foul. I so Luke, you keep up your effort in practice, you keep blocking passes, you keep going, okay, you keep on, you keep on keeping on.